it's this like magical kind of experience where you you know you're looking through this box and you turn your head and all of a sudden you realize oh wow like I look in a different direction and I and I see something you know like I would expect if I was looking in real life it really does surprise people when you hand them a cardboard box and the quality of the experience is what it is. Dodocase got into the virtual reality headset space because we kind of keep in a close eye on the mobile accessory space. And when we saw Google release it at their conference, we realized, wow, you can really turn your smartphone into a, a compelling virtual reality system. And uh, we want it to be fast to bring that to market and we hop right on it. It's something that's so affordable, so accessible. It's really you know, the Model T Ford of, of virtual reality. This is the current uh, DK2 Oculus, which is uh, what we do a lot of our desktop development on. Um, it's a super awesome piece of hardware. It's got positional tracking, um, rotational tracking. It's just like kind of the definitive VR experience right now. Uh, cardboard is also awesome and it gives you the ability to kind of like be in another place. It doesn't have positional tracking and so you can't see things from different angles, uh, but it's still an awesome an awesome device. It's really easy to get your hands on. And this is the piece that we feel like is, is really great for kind of like getting the word out and for getting people comfortable in VR, for just being able to like share it with our friends and family and just like everybody should be able to pick these things up. They're super cheap, what, like five bucks or something. Seeing Google get into like the VR game is very important. You know, it's like important for the whole of the community. When people first try out VR, uh, their minds kind of expand in terms of like what you can do with it. Uh, Oculus has come out and said they want to target gamers because they know that they have these um, really beefy computers at home that can, that can run these things fast. In terms of cardboard, um, it is an entry level thing and so you can see it as a way for people to, um, you know, share like photo spheres or share like 360 degree video. Um, these kind of like entry level technologies in the VR space. Uh, and so I guess those are two good examples of like the first pieces of content you'll see on cardboard that, that really change the way people are thinking about, um, well, what VR is.